It's judgment time as the couples finally come face to face across the table. My first impression when I walked into your house was I couldn't find anything with anybody's personality because I don't feel like your kids feel very free to express anything. From the minute you had your first meltdown, those kids weren't going to express anything to you. You got to stop having the meltdowns okay. and running and hear you what know, somebody says. All right, says. listen, you know what? I don't even want to get into it with you. I don't care what you want. No, I'm going to no, tell you what listen, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to go on to the next subject. The next subject is the dresser incident. When I was told that that's what I was supposed to do to do what you would do, I felt so terrible. Oh, you so you had a right to go in my room and so, take go into my dresser drawers? Yeah, now you know how your kids feel when you throw their stuff parent, on the floor. Parent, child, parent, child. Let's review again. Double parent, standard. Child. Double standard. Oh, so your kid can go out and drink beer till uh, midnight if you, I, if you do? You know what? Do you or don't? I don't have to worry about those things with my kids. That's right, because you don't have rules. They can do whatever they want. No, you know what? My kids are good kids. They don't act like robots and have great Michelle, personalities. wait a minute. Your kids are good kids? Yeah, yeah. they are. I've never seen or heard the F word more in my entire life than I did spending the last two weeks with your family. Even little Autumn calling me And you smile at that like it's funny. I went to Todd, and of course, in your house, it was just a joke. Are you, kid are you kidding me right now? You know, the kids were being the kids, and from your standpoint, that was completely wrong. And from me, I was kind of laid back and lax, and I'm like, just going to chill, you know? I did not feel that Todd was a, a good parent at all. He wants to be their friend. You've got to step up and make the difficult decision that says I'm raising a child. I mean, that's your lifestyle. It works for you. It doesn't work for me. And th that's personally the way I feel. It came time for rule change, and they were going to talk like a sailor. They were going to clean like a sailor. Mm -hmm. So they all got toothbrushes, including Todd. Mia, she's not going to do it. There's a consequence. I took everything out of her closet and threw it in one pile on the floor. And it was truly to prove a point to me that I meant business. So I think it was a valuable lesson. And I can tell you, if it ever she doesn't behave, throw the stuff out on the floor, because she hated it. I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> it was awesome. But I agree. I see where I could be a little firmer, because I do let a lot slide. You have lost your personal identity because you live, eat, and breathe your family, and you really, really, really need to do something for Michelle. I, I do need to do a little more for myself. I don't do very much for myself sometimes. You deserve it. You're a good mom. Your kids love you.